from Utah's first TV station. ABC 4 News at 6 starts now. Good evening and happy Friday. I'm Glenn Mills. Thanks so much for joining us tonight. Clinton police say Wednesday's Amber Alert is still in place, even though the missing baby's mother who took her claims she has legal guardianship. ABC 4's Rosie Nguyen explains where the custody battle gets messy and why investigators are still looking for her. According to documents released by Taylor Webb's attorneys, the fight over guardianship began at the beginning of November when doctors in California put her in a medically induced coma. During that period of time, her mother, Paula Webb, quickly ran to the court without giving the father or anybody else notice and obtained a guardianship because Taylor was in a, a coma. Weinberger says after she woke up and was released from the hospital, she and baby Audrey moved to this home in Clinton to live with her mother. Webb says the living situation was abusive, with police confirming that they were called to this house back on the 18th. The officers on scene that night were told that the, this process, there was a safety plan in place, but that the process was still pending. But Webb claims she, quote, fled from her mother's house on the 20th with baby Audrey and is now, quote, safe and sound in California. That's when Clinton police say they issued the Amber Alert. What we're receiving from California is that that order is still in effect and valid. Maternal grandmother is recognized as the guardian of the child. But Webb and her attorney say there's two reasons to dispute that. One, the guardianship papers were never properly served to her by her mother. And two, Taylor has been discharged from the hospital, and that was the basis for the guardianship. So the basis of the guardianship no longer exists. Clinton police say until they can verify with California officials that baby Audrey is safe, the Amber Alert stays in place. This investigation remains about Audrey. She is the subject of the Amber Alert. She has yet to be located. Reporting in Clinton, Rosie Nguyen, ABC4 News.